Here at WUSA 9, we believe the environment matters, and you've probably heard us talk about the importance of our local oysters. Not only are they delicious to eat, but they also support a healthy aquatic environment. And right now, scientists are working on new technology to help oyster farmers collect and protect their crops. The $10 million USDA-funded project has a goal of making shellfish farming more sustainable, and the stars of the show are robots. One robot scans the surface underwater, collecting detailed images of oysters. While another stays on the water's surface using a sonar device that creates images over a broader area. And what we're trying to do is to improve the production for farmers, at the same time, try to preserve the environment. Oysters actually help to uh, clean water, right? So, and also provide habitat for a lot of other species and it's also going to benefit the environment in the long run. So, I mean, this is a win-win project for me. Miao Yu is leading this project, but it's her students that are doing a lot of the work. Utilizing AI and machine learning, this technology will map out oyster inventory so farmers can be more precise about where they're harvesting oysters, saving them time and fuel. The information will be available to farmers through a phone app a big step up from the current techniques used by farmers, some of which are over 200 years old. We can bring this technology to better tell what is going on with your resource, what the population is, what the growth rate is, that'll help us plan uh, that production down the line. Don Webster has been working with the College of Agriculture and Natural Resources through the University of Maryland Extension for 50 years and is all too familiar with the sharp decline in oysters the Bay has been trying to bounce back from since the mid-1980s. He's hoping this technology will help turn the industry around. I'd like to see our uh, fast food chains arguing over who has the best oyster sandwich. Can you imagine? Now this is first of its kind technology and while it's being developed right in our backyard, the university has partners on the West Coast and Gulf Coast because the goal is to ultimately be able to use this resource all around the country. Dr. Yu also told me this really is just scratching the surface of what AI robotics and technology can do.